Hey Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Made for Love and welcome to your mid-month mini update. See, I can see that tongue. I can see that tongue twister. Okay. And we're just going to have a look at um, the person that you're watching this video for. And we're just going to take a look at their headspace, heart space and messages from their higher self. Okay. The things that they would say to you if they had no fear, if they had no ego, if they were not in another commitment. Okay. So let's get into this reading. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we have a t we have a difficult situation. Something that's going to be challenging to bring together. Something that has a lot of secrets, but somebody who still wants to offer, they want to offer their love to somebody who they consider consider their high priestess, somebody who is spiritually developed and connected to divine. Yeah, somebody's ready to offer their love because they view this person as their total wish fulfillment. Sagittarius, are you in love? Are you in love and are you ready to go after your happiness? Because this is what I'm seeing here right now. You are in love. Are you ready to? Okay, you see what I'm saying? This card kept coming out. Somebody is getting ready to make an offer. Or to bring an apology to someone else right so this is a page of Pentacles so sometimes this usually represents a gift it's an offer sometimes a small offer it's an apology but I'm looking at the size of this Pentacle it may seem small but this is a really big thing for this person whatever they're coming to offer you and we have earth energy coming true strongly from the get-go okay so when your person thinks about you when your person thinks about this connection, how are they processing it mentally? All right. So what they're looking at right now, they're looking back on the past and they are seeing that they were unfair to you. They were unfair to you. It was an unfair situation. It was a situation that had no balance, you know? And they're feeling pretty guilty about that because they've recognized the, the, the full truth of their actions and their words. So they want to make this right. This is Libra energy here. They want to make it right. Now remember this is energy, so it could be flipped. So it could be that you want to make it right, Sagittarius. Okay. Yeah, so this person no longer wants to be defensive. And they want to open up their heart. They want to offer their treasure, their bounty to someone else. I guess it's you. This energy here. Taurus. Virgo. Capricorn. Now, your person could think that you have let them go. Because when we see the four of pentacles in the upright, it means somebody holding on to a situation. But your person could be viewing you as walk, having walked away or let go of um, the situation with them because it was unfair. There was some injustice that was done. And it could be some karma... Um, at play some karmic debt that needs to be paid off yeah um, your person is ready to reveal some sort of secret to you um, this secret could involve a third party because this usually represents um, the outside woman or the third party in a relationship so th they're ready to re make this reveal they're coming forward there's some secret that they have and they're ready to make this reveal this card could also um, give the message that um, your person isn't using their intuition at this point in time and they should be listening to their intuition or or they should have listened 
to their intuition with regard to this um the situation this connection in their heart space what are they thinking about they're thinking about offering commitment to you this is the hierophant this is taurus energy this is wisdom in their heart space they've gained this wisdom they've gained this insight that you are their person okay so they're thinking about offering commitment to you they're thinking about making you a solid offer in the material world this is the ace of pentacles this is about bringing all your bounty forward and offer it to someone so they want to make you a solid offer this is one of the most positive cards of the minor arcana and this is what they're feeling in their heart space and we have a lot of major arcana on the board we have the hierophant we have justice we have um the high priestess so this person is having major changes going on in their life and this could be you sagittarius your person sagittarius feels that yeah they really feel that you've left them out in the cold they, they think that you've left them behind completely as i said the energy can be in reverse so this could be how you feel sagittarius but your person feels like they're in the cold in their heart space they're feeling the loss of you not being there and they're kind of confused and they're indecisive so we have earth energy here and then we have fire energy here i'm um, leo sagittarius aries this person's indecisive but it's like they're, they're waiting for some kind of message from the universe some sign that will that will that that will show them the way forward that's what they're waiting on right now that's what they're feeling in their heart space but they're definitely thinking about commitment to you and the higher front is also the marriage card so it's a serious commitment okay so we're going to go into my um divine counterparts and separation deck and it's finally printed and um finally ready for distribution it was supposed to be ready at um month end but it's ready a little earlier so the first tranche of pre-orders will go out um this saturday saturday the 20th of april so if you want to be in that tranche you can um email me and instructions for ordering this deck will be in, in the description box okay and it'll be shipped out on saturday 20th And every Saturday thereafter will be the post office run. All right, we're going to get four cards. Since we saw the hierophant there, and that's all about commitment and marriage. Let me turn these cards over one time. Yeah, okay. Okay, Sagittarius, <clears throat> your person has been seeing signs and synchronicities that are pointing them in your direction. This could be in the form of recurring numbers, feathers, um, everything that they see reminds them of you. Okay, so here it goes. My love, I'm, I'm experiencing so many synchronicities. I have no idea what to do. And in fact, one of these synchronicities is 3-3. Three, three. I see it everywhere. Everywhere I turn, I turn, I see 3-3. Three, three. Everywhere I turn, I'm in right of you. I see your name. I see your name in signposts. I see buses going to your town in, in the, where you live. Everything reminds me of you. And as much as I want to come towards you, as much as I, I think about you all the time, I just need some space right now. Even though the distance between us is killing me, I am getting ready to answer the call of destiny. I know that you are my destiny. I've been told that by the universe. This is what these synchronicities are all about. I know that you're my destiny. But right now, I just need space to sort my life out. But I'm coming towards you. I don't care how to how I get there, whether it's by train, boat, plane, I don't care. 
I am going to answer the call of destiny. I am going to come towards you. Okay. So Sagittarius, that was your reading. I hope you enjoyed it. And of course, I do do love readings. And I can look into your specific situation. You just, um, you'll see the um, instructions in the description box. Okay. All right. Take care, guys. Okay. Bye.